While computers may seem like outdated technology to some in today's world, they are a reliable way to produce a hard copy of documents even today. And if you're just using your iPhone or iPad for your day-to-day -day computing, AirPrint compatible printers will keep you printing without any issues whatsoever. Apple's AirPrint is undoubtedly one of the finest options for printing. You can print deep impact photos and documents from your macOS and iOS devices. The most notable part is probably that no download or installation of any drivers are needed. We've listed down the top 5 best AirPrint printers and their key features, plus the things to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all products mentioned in the video are available in the description. You could also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, bluemoo.com. Number 5. HP DeskJet 2655 Ready to print, scan, and copy, the HP DeskJet 2655 is an ideal budget-friendly option for printer owners who want to print wirelessly via AirPrint. With bonus options such as instant ink refill, the DeskJet 2655 is one of HP's most affordable wireless printing options. And you can save up to 50% on ink refills via the optional subscription that's delivered right to your door. Measuring 16.74 by 11.97 by 5.87 inches and weighing only 7 pounds, the 2655 is ready to handle a maximum 25 sheet capacity, 7.5 black printed ppm and up to 5.5 color ppm. Its support size is letter and legal paper, as well as 4x6, 5x7 and 8x10 inch photos and number 10 envelopes. The hassle-free setup works great with Mac computers, while HP's all-in-one printer remote app allows non-iOS devices to print wirelessly in addition to AirPrint. Number 4. Canon PIXMA TS9120 The size and weight of this printer is one of its chief selling points. When assembled and closed, the printer measures a mere 14.7 by 14.2 by 5.6 inches. At just 14.6 pounds, it's also relatively light. Any healthy adult should be able to lift, carry, and position this wireless printer with ease. The PIXMA TS9120 draws paper from two sources, the slide-out cassette on the bottom and the vertical paper tray on the back. Both hold a maximum of 100 sheets of paper. They take paper up to a maximum size of 8.5 by 14. The control panel of this AirPrint printer is a spacious 5-inch touchscreen. Its interface is colorful, bright, and intuitive, and the touch display is consistently snappy and responsive. The menu flow doesn't leave any guesswork. In many cases, you can start printing, copying, or scanning directly from the control panel without having to interact with any other device. Number 3. HP OfficeJet 250 HP stretches the definition of portability with the OfficeJet 250. At 15 inches long, nearly 8 inches wide and weighing over 6 pounds, it's a behemoth among mobile wireless printers. On the flip side, the OfficeJet packs a lot of features into that bold chassis, including a second fold-out tray for scanning and a 2-inch LCD touchscreen. The printer tray folds down from the top and neatly locks back into place without the need of a latch. The power outlet, USB port, cable not included, and battery pack are all located in the rear, leaving the rest of the exterior smooth and matte. The glossy interior features a power button on the left along with three indicator lights for power, battery life, and Wi-Fi. A 2 by 1.5 inch LCD screen on the right can be popped up at a 45 degree angle by pressing down firmly above the screen. The touchscreen features icons and menu that can be scrolled through and selected, as well as phone-like home and back buttons to make navigation a breeze. The interior includes another fold-out tray that slides forward and extends for scanning documents. Both printer trays include movable paper guides to adjust the correct paper size. Moving the left guide automatically moves the right one, making the edges shrink or expand as needed. The guides need a bit of force to move, but they feel quite sturdy. Number 2. Canon PIXMA IP110 Wireless Printer While fully closed, the Canon PIXMA IP110 more closely resembles a gigantic exterior hard drive than a printer, measuring just over a foot long and weighing 4.3 pounds. 
It's too bulky to comfortably carry around, but still small enough to be considered portable, whether it's in a suitcase for work or to a friend's house. The all-black buttonless exterior features rubber feet on the bottom and two ports on either side, one for the 16-volt power cord and the other for a USB 2.0 A to B cable. The only physical setup the Pixma requires is plugging in the power cable and installing the ink cartridges. With the printer tray open, the printhead cover can be opened which automatically moves the ink to the middle, giving easy access to the cartridges. Installing ink cartridges is as easy as slotting them in, back first, and gently pushing on the front of the cartridge, which is clearly labeled push. Removing them is almost as easy, with a push button for release. Both color and black ink cartridge slots feature warning lights that blink if low ink is detected. A purely wireless printer can be tricky to set up, and the Pixma does not include a USB cable. The box does include a CD with the install files or they can be downloaded from the official Canon website. Installation via Windows 10 PC proved challenging and frustrating, resulting in error messages when we tried to connect the printer via the standard cableless setup with our standard home Wi-Fi network. Canon advertises the Pixma printing speed at 9 pages per minute. Our own tests clocked the printing speed slightly slower. A 5-page, 1500-word black and white text document took about 40 seconds, as did a single full-page heavily highlighted and colored spreadsheet. When printing text-only documents, we tested a variety of font styles, sizes, and formatting. The quality of printed and color text was crystal clear. We never saw any issues with ink smudging or legibility. Heavily colored and highlighted documents and spreadsheets did have a tendency to curl the edges of the paper, which is pretty common. Number 1. Brother HL L8360 CDW The Brother HL L8360 CDW is an office air print printer that has the power and heft necessary to satisfy the needs of a workspace with a heavy print load. Any member of your team should be able to connect to and print from it with ease. It makes professional quality documents quickly and reliably and is an excellent workhorse as long as you don't need to scan or copy anything. At a glance, it's evident that the Brother HL L8360 CDW is a heavy-duty printer. It's a color laser printer of the sort you'd expect in a medium-sized office. Professionally designed, sturdy, and intuitive to use. The wireless office printer measures 17.4 by 19.1 by 12.3 inches. While it's not the biggest printer in the world, it definitely can't share a desk with someone. It's also not designed to sit on the floor, so you'll, need a place so you'll need to place it somewhere elevated like a table, countertop, or a pedestal. However, its wireless design makes finding a spot for it much easier. There are two paper trays on this office printer. The bottom pull-out tray from which it draws paper holds 250 sheets. It's one of the most intuitive components on this printer. Any office worker should be able to refill it without any issue. If you pull down the hatch on the front panel, the second paper tray folds down, a front tray that holds up to 50 sheets of paper. When the panel is open, the printer will draw paper from the front tray rather than the bottom. Useful if you need to quickly put in some extra sheets for an underway print job. It's also where you'll put things for special print jobs, like envelopes. The output paper tray can hold up to 150 sheets of paper, more than enough to catch everyone, even massive projects. At 48.1 pounds, it's a heavy machine. While one person may be able to move and adjust it, it probably should be a two-person operation. We found it awkward to carry, and while nothing ever went wrong, we could tell that if you dropped this printer, you could potentially hurt yourself badly. Did this video help you find what you were looking for? If so, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Have a good day!